I recently switched up the software that I use for my scheduler on my website. I used to use Calendly, and there's a lot of other ones out there, but I recently switched to one that's all inside of WordPress that is actually way more powerful when I show you how and why that is. Um, and I wanna show you what I did. It's a really, really cool platform. Awesome for WordPress-based membership sites, by the way. Anybody running a coaching program, let's get into it. So for a long time, I was using Calendly as my scheduler. So when people would want to go and they book strategy calls and over other things with me, they would go to a page on my website and they would book using Calendly. And it worked pretty well, um, but I had a desire to switch it up a little bit. As you guys may uh, know, I'm a big fan of keeping everything in-house and not relying on too many third-party services. Uh, Calendly works pretty well, but it is remotely hosted, okay? And in order to get some of the good things that you might want, you do have to pay for Calendly. Um, and I did pay for it for quite some time, and then I was using the freebie version for a little while. But I was like, okay, if I've got so much of my business inside of WordPress, why can't I bring the scheduler into WordPress as well? And so I went looking around to see what the options might be, and I found one, and I think the reason I found it here is actually because uh, I am a massive fan and user of WP Fusion. And so one day I was in there in the documentation looking at their integrations, and they had an area there for events, and it listed out various booking calendars and things that WP Fusion works with, and there's this one there, and I was like, whoa, okay, because if you can integrate WP Fusion with the scheduler, that means that I can make Fluent CRM send out emails and do all kinds of automated things after an appointment or after they've booked an appointment or what have you. And that's really cool. That's kind of the kind of functionality you would have to, to pay Calendly for. I can do it all built in. So let me show you what that is. Okay, that plugin is called Simply Schedule Appointments, and it works out really well. If you go to the homepage at simplyschedulepointments.com, or you can just click the link below, um, you can see what it can do. But it's a standard, um, almost everything that Calendly does, except it, you could do it all inside of WordPress. Um, as it says, no coding required. It's all built right in. Uh, being that it works inside of WordPress, it works with a lot of the different plugins out there. It also works with some external ones, but see how it's got integration with Divi and Elementor and Beaver and of course WP Fusion. That's the big one for me. Um, you can also take payments through it uh, via Stripe and PayPal and stuff like that. Although, you know, it being that it's inside of WordPress, you can technically use any cart you want. WooCommerce, easy digital downloads, it doesn't really matter, but the plugin can do it directly as well if you'd like. Um, it can work with gravity forms and formidable forms, so you can actually have, you know, really fancy forms that you've built with something like gravity, and the scheduling function is literally built right into the darn thing. Really neat. Um, it does work with external systems like Google Calendar. Uh, you know, where's the other one? Uh, there it is, Zap uh, that one is interesting because it allows you to integrate with all kinds of things, as you know. But I don't really like to use Zapier very much. It's not that it's a bad system. It's just that it's another third-party appendage to the business, and I kind of like to have everything in-house. And so this works really, really well. The fact that you could just drag and drop your scheduler in using Elementor, that's essentially what I did, works really well. Of course, there's a short code, and there's also a Gutenberg block if you want to use the block editor. But So there's a lot of different ways to do this, and it just integrates with the WordPress stack really, really well. Now, when you go into WordPress and you click on appointments, it's going to open up this. This is basically the control panel for Simply Schedule Appointments. And you can see I've got an appointment coming up later today. Uh, but you'll notice how it basically overwrites the entire control panel. That's one thing I don't really like. It works totally fine, but I would prefer that it was a little bit more native to the admin area of WordPress. It just feels better that way. But if you go to appointment types, you can set up as many different appointment types as you want. My business is pretty simple. So right now I've only got one, but you can have as many as you want, um, which is actually an interesting thing because some of the other third party remotely hosted cal calendars, uh, you need to pay to be able to do stuff like that. With with this, there's no limitations. I have as many different appointment types, each with their own availability, etc., etc. When you go over to settings, you've got all kinds of different options here. 
Um, um, I'll mention a few of these. Blackout dates is important because you can actually say, well, certain times or like say a vacation, certain dates in your normal availability, you're just not going to be available. You can black them out. Now, one thing is, is that it does not yet have blackout times where you can say, well, like, let's say I've got a dentist appointment later. I need to just block out from one to three, but otherwise you're available on that day. It does not have that capability right now, but it does work with Google Calendar. So if you, and it will actually look at your Google Calendar and you can say, monitor these calendars for conflicts. And so you could just use Google Calendar and you could say, well, between one and three, I've got a dentist appointment. And as long as it's on that calendar, simply schedule, or what's this thing called again? Simply schedule appointments um, is going to see that and it will block it out and they cannot schedule, okay? But it integrates with Zoom, which I also do use it'll automatically set up the zoom meeting for people who schedule it does have webhooks um, in, in the pro version which I am not using I'm simply using the plus version uh, but this would allow you to integrate it with a bunch of different things plus again with the WP fusion integration I don't even need this darn thing because um, I can make uh, fluent CRM send off webhooks all day long using the tags um, it's got uh, you know tracking it, you can have multiple uh, people involved and schedule different team members it's got a lot of cool things a lot of which I am not using but that is essentially the control panel in a nutshell. One thing I wish that it didn't have was all this stuff over on the side. I just feel like it is advertising uh, for upgrading my license and things like that. And I just don't feel like they should be advertising to me for something that I've already purchased. Uh, but hey, just a little pet peeve, no big deal. Popping over here over to WP Fusion, when the WP Fusion plugin actually detects the presence of the plugin for simply schedule appointments, we've got this little section here. And so what now we can apply tags for when somebody books, when somebody reschedules, or when somebody cancels. And of course, if you know any marketing automation platform, you know that we can use these tags to trigger automations, send them emails, do anything that we want. Uh, a lot of flexibility behind these three little fields. Now this check box here just says sync guest bookings with, in my case, Fluent CRM. Um, and that means that they can book and they can enter their information via the scheduler directly and Fluent CRM will then, or sorry, WP Fusion will add them to the list and Fluent CRM and trigger everything that needs to be done. Um, and uh, so I have that turned on, even though in my case, on my site, people have to already be a member of the site before they can access the scheduler anyway. And so it's, <laughs> I probably could uncheck that. But this is a very, very powerful set of three fields here when coupled with a marketing automation platform. Now, if we pop over to contact fields, let's pop on down. Uh, this is where WP Fusion can sync up uh, various fields with fields in the CRM. And so you can have a, a start and end dates, appointment notes, various things associated with the booking. You can actually put those into the CRM, uh, mapping it to a field, okay? And then you'll be able to put those as merge fields into your emails and, and include their uh, appointment date and stuff like that. Now, one thing to note uh, is that as of now, it does not have the ability, it does not have a separate field for the time, okay? That's just a little limitation. Um, it's not that big of a deal and there are other ways to get around it, but uh, it does. it's only the date. And so you might have to change the uh, email a little bit accordingly. And lastly, this is the scheduler page on blogmarketingacademy.com. So you can see what this looks like. Now I have done a little bit of custom styling here, uh, but you can just pop on through here. Um, now I only have one appointment type. If I had multiple appointment types, I would be able to choose what I'm going to be booking and that type of thing. You, you have short codes for individual appointment types. And so you've got a lot of flexibility there for scheduling different types of things, but I've only got the one uh, and you can kind of see how this looks. Now, one cool thing about this is this feature about upcoming appointments. Now, obviously I'm in my own profile and so I do not have anything scheduled with myself. That'd be weird. But the fact that this is there is really cool. You There actually is a widget and you can drag it over from Elementor or anything else where you can display upcoming appointments. And so the person could be logged into their profile and you can display this right on the dashboard or what have you. So they see what appointments that they have coming up if they booked anything for you. That can be really handy, especially uh, if you do a lot of coaching and that type of thing. And let's say you've got a, a customer portal or a member portal and you want to display those upcoming appointments. It's really super easy to do. And it, it, it's right on your site. It's not like they have to go and rely on their calendar or ask you or something like that. 
Okay, so when you go to their website right now, the WP Fusion integration is a little understated. They, I feel like they should probably feature it a little bit more because built in, um, simply schedule appointments only works with MailChimp and MailChimp sort of sucks. I would never recommend it to anybody. As it turns out, I mean, if, if you, unless you use Zapier to integrate with other things, WP Fusion is the way to make this plugin work with almost any CRM that you want. Now, I happen to use Fluent CRM because I really like it and it's built right into WordPress and it works great. But you could be using anything, Active Campaign, Drip, you know, almost name almost any CRM. I think WP Fusion works with like 50 of them. And so you have a lot of flexibility there. But that marketing automation capability of that uh, CRM is what gives you a lot of capability with regard to the follow-ups when people book with you. It's not just sending them a reminder of their appointment. It's literally things like you can uh, do automatic upsell sequences to them after the appointment is over. You can do things like when they, um, uh, after an appointment is done, let's say the next day you want your marketing automation platform to automatically send them an email asking for a testimonial to see how it went or to see if they want to rebook another time with you. You've got a lot of capability there when you use a marketing automation platform in conjunction with your scheduler. And this combo works great. Um, if you were to use a third party system such as Calendly, there are some CRMs that it works with for sure, but you are relying on you using one of the CRMs that it's compatible with, um, or you're, you're going to need to use something like Zapier. And again, you're going to have to pay specifically for that uh, capability with Calendly. Um, so, um, it, so this is a really powerful system. I'm really happy that I switched to it and it's all built right in which is great again there's a few little minor things and if you go below in the actual blog post i'll make note of some of the things that i think that they should change about this plugin um, but overall it's pretty good and they are maintaining it now you might ask how do you get it it's uh, pretty easy there actually is a free version of simply scheduled appointments and it will do the basics of putting a scheduler on your site and it will not cost you anything the good thing is that the wp fusion integration works with the free version so that combo actually is really really powerful and you can get a scheduler for nothing now if you do want to be able to work with google uh calendar if you want to be able to put custom fields into your scheduler and some of that type Type of thing uh, you'll need to upgrade it starts at $99 currently for the plus version and then it goes up from there now that's for a year of support and updates but again it's a WordPress plugin it's not going to stop working if you decide not to renew it it's kind of up to you how you want to handle it and that's the cool thing that I like about uh, WordPress plugins is you're in control all right Okay, so that is Simply Schedule Appointments. It's a bit of a long title for a plugin, but it works because it is sort of simple, really. Um, I think it's gonna be the best fit for anybody who operates a WordPress-based membership site, even if it's a small one like a customer portal or a coaching portal. Uh, it works really well because you, you're they're, they're gonna be developing profiles on your site. They're gonna be logging in. They'll be able to see their upcoming appointments. They'll be able to easily book with you. You've got the marketing automation capability behind the scenes, especially when when you work whoa, when you work with WP Fusion, uh, and it's a really, really great platform. If you have any questions at all, feel free to post a comment, and I will answer you. You can also go ask them if you want. Totally fine. Uh, but you get the idea. All right. We'll talk to you later.